How's everybody doing? All right. We feel the same way.
Young Wesley. That's a song by the great Russ Barenberg called Through the Gates. Sing a really beautiful uh, Buddy and Julie Miller song that we really love. 
and we're happy that Andy brought it to the band.
Follow the bouncing ball. I don't know, any people in the back probably didn't catch it, but the little ball thing on my mallet there came off. It bounced, bounced off Allie's shoulder, came back, bounced, and I caught it and put it back on. <laughs> It was all planned. I, you know, it took a lot of rehearsal. Yeah, yeah, just, just to just to prove that, that festival vending works. I mean, I mean, Timmy just bought that drum at a festival and we used it the, the next hour on stage. <laughs> <laughs> festival vending, it works. Close enough. Right, this is a true story. All this shit that I'm about to sing actually happened to me. Flowers 
out of the click I went out with my band Put a little tour together Was more than a three night stand I was gone a month when I came back again I took the flowers to the record shop But it was boarded up and I never saw her Sally Curl on the violin. Cole Missouri what? Johnny Grove! Johnny Grove! Johnny Grove on the bass. Always good to be here. The weather's doing crazy things to this guitar, I North and west of here, it's actually substantially north and west of here. It's a true story about what happened up there back in the 1940s. It was a big fire, big fire. And uh, everybody know what smoke jumpers are? If you live in Colorado, you know what smoke jumpers are, I can tell you that. This is a song about a guy named Dodge, it's a smoke jumper. Tell them about the science behind it though, Timmy. The trick. Okay, all right, I'll see my favorite out. part. This guy was thinking on his feet. He got caught in a big fire, and so everybody knows the fire burns at like 3,000 degrees, and it can chase you at 50 miles an hour. And they got caught, and they had to run uphill away from it. And they came into a clearing that had waist-high grass, and he was like, oh, wait a minute, I know what. So he takes a match out, and he lights the grass on fire. And he just says, come on, guys, lay down in this. And the fire, you know, this is the only chance. We're gonna die unless you do. And uh, he and two guys decided that was a good idea. Or was it, yeah, no, he and one other. <laughs> and the rest of them continued up the hill and they all died. Sorry, yeah, it's not a very happy song, but it is what it is. Yeah, you gotta work but this is told from the story of his dying bed and uh, there's a reporter there, hey, let me tell me, tell me about that old story, that thing that happened to you back then. On the chart there at the foot end of the bed They think I'm blind, I can't read it 
Read in every word, every word it says is death. So confession, not the reason why you came. Get it off my chest before I check out of the game. Well, now that you mention it, there's 13 things I'll name. 13 crosses high above, coals of you all are loose. August 49, in North Montana. Honest D on the record and the fires tend to dry. Lightning strikes in the mountains. I'm screeching back the jump base. I'm prepared the boys to fly. I pick the drop zone. 347 comes in low. I see the circle of the fire down below. Feel the tap on the leg that tells you go. 15 of us drop below. The cold is all you want. I'd seen bigger. So I ordered them the side hill. We'd fight it from below. We'd have our back to the river. Have it licked by morning, even if we took it slow. But the far crown jumped the valley just ahead. There's no way down. We're gonna fight that slow. It's too big to fight it. Gonna fight that hill instead. Friends won't step behind the boat. to safety, death was 50 yards behind. I don't know why, I just thought it. A little match to waste high grass, running out of time. I tried to tell them, step into this fire, I've said, there's no way down. This is the only chance you get. But they cursed me and they ran for the rocks above instead. Step behind the Survive. I stayed that night, one day after, carrying bodies to the river, wondering how that I'd survive. Thirteen stations of the cross to mark your fall. I've had my say, I confess to nothing more. I'm gonna join them now, those that left me long before. Thirteen crosses high above the cause of rewards. Thirteen crosses high above.
Johnny Grubb. I can't get down there right now. I know, but I'm not everybody else. I want to send this song out to Andy Thorne if he's an earshot. Andy Thorne. Y'all know Colonel Andy Thorne. Don't worry, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to be on the mic like that. This is a North Carolina ghost story. Yeah. <laughs>
this alley crawl up here and have a sing a song for you. fucking peep. Next thing you know, she's fucking oh, Dolly Parton.
Johnny Growth. We drew, we drew straws who was going to follow that one. I did, I did not win.
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. I didn't quite hear that. What, what, what was his name again? I want a recording of this, and I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna put it on his. I'm gonna keep leaving that message on his phone. <laughs> All right, here's a song that uh, John and I wrote, and it's about coming home. I live in the Delaware Water Gap in Pennsylvania, and I go there when I can. <laughs> <laughs>
Thank you all so much. Well, you know, this. here's a song that's uh, it's another sad song. We had a, we do them, you know? Life is sad sometimes. That's why it's so poignant and beautiful because then you get to appreciate the beautiful shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we had the pleasure of playing at uh, the Falcon Ridge Folk Festival and uh, <clears throat> a gentleman named Dave Carter wrote this song and um, he was to play that festival and uh, two weeks before the festival he passed away suddenly from a heart attack and so they decided to have a big you know tribute to him and they asked everybody every band to play a dave carter song and so i said has anybody done when i go has anybody chosen that nobody wanted to play this song we did
whisper and turn I will rattle like dry leaves when I grow Stand in the mist where my fire used to burn I will camp on the night breeze when I grow Well, listen, we've, we've had such a great time here, and this is one of my favorite festivals in the world. And uh, Colorado River, baby. Oh, man. That's the shit right there. We got one more tune for you, and, we're, and we want to thank you so much. Really, we love you all. And uh, stay tuned. There's lots more great music. Let's hear you, come on. 
Can I have the, can I, uh, one more time, yeah. It's, yeah, hello. All right, you can hear me, I can't hear me. John Skeen on the mandolin. <laughs> Allie Kroll on the violin and the vocals. Andy Gesson on the guitar and the banjo. Johnny Grove. <laughs> My name's Tim Carbone and we are the shock and awe boys and girls.